Every holiday season is unique and different in its own special way, but some things never change. Every year, the, no the news shows those last-minute Christmas shopping pieces. And tonight, instead of traveling out to Crabtree Valley Mall, we're traveling back in time. We dug into the WRAL archives and found one of these classic holiday stories told by a reporter who's kind of a classic in his own right. Here's WRAL's Fayetteville reporter Gilbert Bays circa a couple decades ago. What do you want for Christmas? Toys. Toys? Time is running out for people trying to answer that question, but for some, last-minute Christmas shopping is a tradition, a piece of Americana. Bill Julian and Karen Smith agree, the best time for Christmas shopping is when you're under pressure to buy. Are you a procrastinator? Absolutely, why not? This is what Christmas is all about. Last Wait, minute. Last minute, best bargains. What do you think about the reindeer here? I think it's pretty nice, but it's not worth $450. You're doing last minute shopping here, you're going to have yeah. to pick up something, the reindeer may be well, in. If I could ride it out here, I would, but it don't move, so I, I'm just going to hold off on it. Ask anyone shopping today why they waited until the last minute, and you'll get some pretty standard excuses. I hate to come out here, but I came anyway, but then I tried to get out here early before it got too crowded, so I'm here. Well, I, I have a couple gifts for her, but I thought I'd better get one more. It's tomorrow, you know. I know it's tomorrow, so that's why I'm here today. Merchants say they don't care when people shop. Better late than not at all. Shop owners are just happy. Troops are not away for a third Christmas in a row, and sales are looking pretty good. Well, maybe there is something to this last-minute Christmas shopping after all. You can relax, the stores are not that crowded, and the longest line in the mall today was the one to see Santa. Last-minute shoppers say procrastinating helps keep their shopping schedule right on track. Gilbert Bays, WRAL TV5 News, Fayetteville. I'm wondering if any of you at home saw someone and said, oh my gosh, that's so-and-so, I know them. If so, let, let us know. I'd love to talk to them. Uh, the nostalgia continues on WRL.com, where you will find stories of only in Raleigh Christmas memories like Crabtree Valley Mall Fountain and the, the mysterious mini tree that hangs over the Beltline.